Next question, Andre. Hi, Greg. My name is Jimmy. Hello, Jimmy. Um, yes, I'd like to know when you when Yes toured with Emerson, Lake, and Palmer. What memories do you have with them? Oh, well, you know, look, I used to live with Chris Squire in a flat in London. People, people always think that Yes and ELP were always at each other's throats, but, it, but it's not true. We had a sort of I don't know, there was a sort of friendly rivalry. They used to call us Henderson, Snake and Charmer. <laughs> and we used to call them Maybe. <laughs> the, funny the funny story was, I remember one time, we, uh, this was in the day, we used to fly by, we had private jets and done. Um, Yes wanted a private jet. And I remember we were competing with, with the same charter companies. And they insisted on having their name on the side of the jet. And uh, so one day, and Chris told me this story, so it's quite all right. One, one day they, they turn up at the airport, there's their jet, you know. And on the fuselage, it's got it. Yes, well, the fuselage. So they're, you know, they're happy about that. They think, when they land, they're going to have, yes, the plane's going to look good. They get on the jet, it takes off, it gets up to altitude, and all of a sudden there's a slurping sound, and then a pop. <laughs> Bang! And the plane goes from 500 miles an hour to 250 miles an hour in a second. And what's happened is, to put yes on the fuselage, they've done it with, with these huge stickers and adhesive. And when they got up to the altitude, the sticker ripped off and blew back in the jet and popped it. And now they had one sticker and one engine left. Can you imagine? All you're waiting for is, and you're gone. You know? as, as it happened, they landed okay. And, uh, and, and then it all was well. But um, as I said, I'm very, very... Uh, close to Chris, known him all my life. Uh, and uh, that's about it really on the Yes Front. We get on together and um, of course they're a wonderful band who've sustained for many, many years. I really respect them.